If you're looking for food, you've got to wait and get your rations like everyone else. That's not why I'm here. I'm Crane. I'm a runner. Anything I should be looking for out there? We're pretty much out of everything. Food, water, medicine. You wouldn't expect Old Town to be poorer than the slums, but it is. Got to admit, it makes me wonder about those rumors of a big supply cache hidden somewhere in the city. Too bad the one person who'd know if it's true is Tabith Erzl. You can't get anything out of him. Where do I find him? Across town. He's not dangerous. He's just difficult. He's the former town clerk, and he can be extremely uh, bureaucratic about things. Try not to kill him. But if you have to kill him, I'll totally understand. Yes, what is it? Are you Mr. Thabit Erdl, the town clerk? That was my title. However, all city authority has been dissolved by the GRE and the federal government. My title does not exist anymore. And therefore, I am no longer required or allowed to provide any services to you or anyone else. In conclusion, goodbye. Not so fast, Mr. Erdl. The dissolution order requires all local officials to be at the service of the GRE and the provisional authority as needed. Are you with the GRE? I'm looking for information about a large supply cache hidden somewhere in the city. Ah, you mean the bunker. Well, if you wish to take possession of it, you'll have to lodge a 201 needs of agency form, JP-401 details of operation form, also a 606 compulsion of special authority form, oh, and a 302B declaration of emergency functions form. That last one has a three-day turnaround in the best of circumstances which these are certainly not. I need it now. Well, then I suggest you employ the traditional method of accelerating the government process. Which is what? Bribery, of course. I need the official seal of the mayor embossing stamp. The mayor was last seen at the hotel. Find his room, and you should find the seal.
Wonderful. I promise to abuse this seal to the fullest extent of my corruption, which is considerable. Tell me about the supply cache. If, if precaution. Old Town supports a very wealthy class of citizens. They knew the slum districts would exhaust their meager supplies, and that the wretched poor would then invade us, like a wave of locusts. So you locked it up? The bunker is under the town hall. I can monitor your progress on the city services band. Radio me if you need some paperwork from the office of the mayor. I'll be generating reams of it. Thabit, are you listening? Oh, if you're in the town hall, could you filch me some stationery from the city council president's chambers? Where's the pass card to enter the bunker? Ah, the pass card, of course. Due to a series of tragic events, the chain of custody of that card has frequently changed. But I believe it finally landed in the capable hands of police captain Halim. That's who you need to get it from. Why hasn't he opened the bunker himself? Regretfully, Captain Halim's interest in material things is no more. He frequently shambles around K Street with several other former police officers. Perhaps they have some vague recollection of their fraternity. Thank you, Captain Halim. By order of the mayor, the entire contents of this bunker now belongs to me! Get away from it, thief!
Isan, this is Crane. I'm in a supply bunker under the town hall. I think we hit the jackpot. That's great news, Crane. Thank you. Did you actually get that beat to help you? Yeah, but I had to kill him in the end. I totally understand. It's me. Name's Crane. Use the elevator. Push the button for the bottom floor. Got it.
Now go down the main corridor. The lab is on the left. When the outbreak happened, Sarah and I stayed in the quarantine to work on the cure. You know who was supposed to protect us? Kadir Suleiman. Rise himself. <laughs> that worked out just perfectly. <laughs> is to the right. Everything went straight to hell after Rise's brother died, you know. Rise went from a guy with monstrous tendencies to a full-blown monster. You'll have to run the decontamination protocol to unlock the doors. It won't work without full power, though. That's where the generators come in. Head to the offices. Once you're there, I'll point you in the right direction. All right, I'm on it. Sarah and I got to safety with the help of a GRE operative, a, a man very similar to you. The operative who helped us was supposed to evacuate alongside us, but you can, uh, you can guess how well that worked out, since Sarah and I both got stuck here. Oh, be extra careful now. I never cleared the infected from that part of the facility, as I never had reason to go in there. <laughs> <laughs> separated from the two of them, but uh, I made it here to this clinic. I, I really had no other option than to work on finding a cure. Watch it. I'm opening the door. Sarah and the operative fell in with Brecken's crowd. I guess I would have as well if I'd been able to get to them. Uh, I'm sorry about this, but the only way to get to the generator room is through the ventilation shafts. The shafts lead to the stock room, and from there you can reach the hallway and then the generators. Push the button by the door to begin the process.
Rain. Glad to be finally shaking hands with you. Now, let's have those tissue samples, shall we? Hey, Doc, you mind if I show you a photo? No, 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 just, just, just one minute. you wanted to say. Hey, that's him. That, that, that's the GRE operative I was telling you about. What's his name? Amir. Yes, yes, Amir Goreshi. What are you doing with a picture of him? We, uh, we had a mutual friend. The samples are still viable. That's good. With some luck, your trip here won't have been for nothing. Uh, where's the rest of the data, by the way? I know Zara prepared two packages. Yeah, I'll have to get back to you on that, Doc. Right now I have some GRE shitheads to confront. GRE? Brain, you watch yourself around them. Their public face is a lie of epic proportions. Those people are all heartless, lying bastards. I hear you, Doc. And thanks. I'll be in touch. Doc, I'll be careful. I just need to figure out where things stand. Troy, I give the samples to Dr. Camden. Now I'm gonna go have a little talk with the GRE. And what are you going to tell them? Everything. I'll meet you later, Troy. This is Crane, do you copy? Kyle Crane, you can hear me, can you not? Rise. Where are you? Exactly where I should be, atop my own tower. Of course, mine is not quite complete, but... It still stands as a monument to chaos, to entropy, to what it means to be ruled only by oneself. I'll kill you for what you did to Jade. For everything, I'll fucking kill you! I had hoped that would be your attitude. You see, we are at war, you and I. A war of opposing philosophies. A war to see whose vision of the world proves true. Come, Crane. Come and challenge me. What is it you Americans are so fond of saying? I dare you. You know what? Forget it. There is no war. There's only your fucked up outlook. Go to hell. Oh, no, 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 no. I won't be going to hell. I will be leaving Arando, you see. I have made a deal with our GRE brothers, using your very own communicator, no less. They know I have all of Dr. Zera's research data. They call it the keys to the kingdom. Very shortly, a helicopter will come and take me away. A 
imagine the damage I shall be able to do outside the confines of these walls. Of course, if you think you can stop me. You crazy son of a bitch! That is what I had hoped to hear. Come and find me, Crane. Let us finish what we began.